All right, today we got these cattle up here in this corner. They haven't seen a dog before, so there will be a little bit of an education process on these cattle. Every day after this, most of these cutters keep them 60 days. Every day after this will be easy. So there will be a little bit of an education process for these cattle. And I'm going to send this dog on his clockwise command, and we'll get, he'll get behind him and start picking him up. So um, I'll try to explain what's going on in the meantime. So come by. There. Their command means to square up. Now you can start walking up to them. Walk. He's feeling of them. First day, first day on the. We'll let him educate these cattle a little bit. So walk there. Walk there. We can't be in a rush because every day after this is real important. It's just going to get that much better every day. So let him adjust these cattle. All them cattle gave off of him right there, so walk him up. Walk. There'll be one of them that needs to test him out probably pretty soon. Down. They might not all be real sure about him. He's going to educate one of these here that's kind of, kind of up there looking at him. They're not sure they need to give off of him yet. Walk. Walk. He should be real steady right there. There. Down. Down. Come by. There. Down. Let him give him a chance to give off of him. He don't need to be educating every one of them. He just needs to do the ones that want to question him. Walk up. These cattle haven't done any trotting around. They ain't loping. They ain't mad. They ain't drooling. They ain't slobbering. We're going to get these cattle up here and they're going to be respectful of that horse when they get there and responsive. And we won't be tearing up a bunch of fences and we're just going to be walking up this alleyway just nice and quiet. Walk. This is kind of a bit of a dark hole for these cattle and they obviously don't have a place to look out the other side. So it's going in more or less blind to them. So this is where it gets you kind of in trouble uh, about pinning these cattle in this situation. But we're just going to walk there down. And we don't want to come in here when we're in a hurry the very first time. The next time it's going to be fine to push on them a little harder. Come by there. Not all these cattle have been educated to a dog yet, so there's going to be a few of them might come out and try them a little bit. But tell me, why is there a misunderstanding about dogs on cattle? I think that um, a lot of people have seen dogs uh, operate.